Hey guys, welcome back to the shop. Today we are going to be turning up one of those magic mushroom bottle stoppers. So uh, if you didn't catch the, the live stream where we cast these, what these are are uh, mushrooms that were growing on trees. I got these from William Fornis on Facebook. He sent them out to me and then I sent them over to my buddy Brad and he die stabilized these mushrooms and they are fabulous. So I cast this one in, uh, I made a blank that was clear resin and just put a little bit of an interference blue, uh, just a little bit in there. So we're going to turn that up today. We already did a pen that was in pearl and it had all the different colors. So um, pretty awesome stuff. Uh, if you missed the casting part, basically all I did was just, you know, we had the mushroom stabilized and uh, all I did was just pour, you know, put them into the, the resin. It wasn't anything difficult because they were already stabilized and the blanks turned out pretty fabulous. So let's get started on this turning. All right, so we have the bottle stopper chucked up on the lathe with my four jaw chuck. What I'm going to do is, uh, first step is I'm going to square off the end, then I'm going to center drill and then drill this with a 5 16 drill bit, probably about an inch deep. Then I'm going to come back with a 3 8 16 tap, which is what you use for the bottle stopper mandrel and for the kits. So we we'll get this to fit on there. Then once we have that, we're going to chuck it up on the mandrel and then just turn it and polish it and we're ready to rock. I just put a little bit of pressure. The tailstock's completely, you know, loose. Just put a little bit of pressure on the tailstock and then just wind in. And go about two and then back off one. It. Fancy dancy. Really like the interference blue powder in this. A little bit. Gives it a little bit of a little bit of a kick. A little pop. 
Well, all right, these magic mushrooms turned out awesome. Uh, I knew right when I opened the box of the, the stabilized mushrooms, I'm like, oh, these are gonna be pretty fun. So uh, really awesome look in the clear. Uh, this stopper really is impressive, if I do say so myself. It, it's just, you know, the, the combination of all the colors and everything and the shapes of them is just amazing. And uh, honestly, all of the blanks that we made with these, uh, the pen, uh, all I did was put pearl white around them and it's fabulous. It's just a really cool embedment and it's super easy. Once you get them stabilized, you know, and, and even the non-dye stabilized ones were pretty cool, but the, the colors in these things with the shapes, amazing. So I hope you guys try this out. It's awesome. I'm not sure what kind of mushrooms they were. Um, they just, to me, they look like the ones that kind of grow on the sides of trees. And, and considering William Fornis, you know, sells wood, I'm guessing that's kind of <laughs> where, you know, where they came from. Not sure exactly which ones they are, though. So if you have any comments or questions, you can leave those down below. If you like the video, definitely hit that like button and share with your friends. It definitely helps out a ton. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you get notified when new videos come out. If you'd like to see these experiments live, head over to my Twitch channel. I do all of the Dunkin' Junk, uh, you know, you know, stuff, the casting and the turning. I do it all live on Twitch. Uh, head over there, hit the follow button. It'll let you know when I go live. Um, on Wednesdays, we do the resin casting portion. The audience gets to choose. Uh, you know, they vote on what we actually are going to be casting in resin. Uh, and I, I get audience help for, you know, colors and what types of blanks and all that kind of stuff. It's really fun. And the chat's fun. Everybody has a good time. So Wednesdays. 2 to 5 p.m. That's the resin casting. And then on Saturdays, 2 to 5 p.m. as well. Uh, both Pacific time, uh, but Saturdays I do the turning. So if you want to see the whole thing and uh, kind of hang out with the, the rest of the Dunkin' Junkies, definitely head over to Twitch. Uh, but until next time, thank you for watching this video, and I'll see you in the next one.